Hi, welcome to this Tech Talk where we'll be discussing some technical topics relating Dynamics 365. My name is Peter Dubois and I'm a technical designer for Dynamics 365 customer engagement and also for integrations within Dynamics 365. Today's topic will be about integrating data between finance and operations and customer engagement. Finance and operations is the ERP solution for Microsoft. Customer engagement is the CRM solution. But first, let's take a step back. What is data integration and why do we want to integrate data between two applications? Normally, when you have an application, the data resides, resides within the database of that application. But it can be that you need this data to be available in the other system as well. Because you need to be able to use this data, you need to be able to manipulate this data, you need changes that are coming from one system, you need those changes to be applied in the other system. That's why we will be using data integration. In today's session, we will be discussing four ways to integrate your data between finance and operation and customer engagement. We'll be talking about dual write, CDS data integrator, virtual entities, and custom connectors. Let's zoom in on the first one, dual write, the new kid on the block at Microsoft. Now this is very special this means of integration is bi-directional. This means that when you perform an update in one application, the update flows through through the other application, but also the other way around without having to do any customizations whatsoever. It's also real time. This means that you don't have to wait for any batch jobs to finish. The moment you perform an update in one system, it gets through to the other system directly. It's also tightly coupled and transactional across applications. This means that when you perform an update on your account in customer engagement, the update will flow through to your customer in finance and operations. When finance and operations validates this data and says your data is not okay, the entire transaction across both applications will be rolled back and canceled. Dual write is meant for low data volumes to integrate between the two applications. If you want to integrate a big amount of data, there are some other options. The second out-of-the-box way to integrate your data between Dynamics Finance and Operations and Dynamics Customer Engagement is the CDS Data Integrator. This way to integrate is unidirectional. This means that when you update a record in one system, it'll flow through to the other system, but not the other way around. Now, there are, there are some ways to make it bidirectional, but this requires some customizations to be done. The Data Integrator is ideal to integrate big data, a lot of data, a big volume of data. However, it is batch based. So this means it's not real time. There might be some time between performing your operation in one system and seeing the results in the other system. A big advantage of the data integrator is that you can use Power Query to perform advanced transforms and advanced filtering. The third way, to integrate your data between Dynamics Finance and Operations and Dynamics Customer Engagement is called Virtual Entities. Although I have to say that integration might not be the technically correct word to describe this. Your data resides in one database, in the Finance and Operation database, but can be visualized in Customer Engagement on your forms and on your views. Virtual Entities are mainly used to visualize your Finance and Operation data in your customer engagement application. However, we do count it as a means of integrating data because some basic operations are still possible. You can create, update, or delete finance and operation records from within the customer engagement application. And it's possible to use the records from finance and operations and link them to existing records in your customer engagement application. Now, if your business requirements are too complex to solve the integration by using dual write, the CDS data integrator, or virtual entities, we can still use the out-of-the-box data connectors to design your integration architecture. We've discussed four ways to integrate your data between Dynamics Finance and Operations and Dynamics Customer Engagement. As you can see, this can be quite a difficult matter. So if you have any questions or concerns or need assistance in designing your integration architecture, please feel free to reach out to us. Now, if you haven't done so, please subscribe to our channel, click the bell icon to be notified when we upload new content. Have a nice day.